Well, the incident continues to escalate. Every effort is being made to contain the fires. In addition to that, OES is deploying resources down to San Diego to assist in recovery efforts. All of a sudden this week we have the weather that we were predicting and the conditions that we were afraid of happen. We have a robust mutual aid system in the state of California. Uh, if the incident continues to grow or if there's multiple incidents like we saw in San Diego this week where they have multiple fires going simultaneously, then the region eventually, uh, as the region runs out of uh, equipment to send, and then they reach out to us. As needs are identified, those needs will gravitate up that chain of succession until they are met by whatever resources are needed. Mostly we deal with fire engines of all types, uh, water tenders of all types, and we call overhead. Um, those strike teams will be composed of various resources to address those incidents. They'll have fire engines with them, they'll have ground crews, uh, they may have liaisons with air resources. Uh, those are composed by the fire personnel on scene and coordinated uh, through the fire incident uh, command posts. Typically we don't see these type of conditions until later in the year. So I think that the citizens of California need to understand that this is a wake-up call. See what's going on. So, uh, that, that, that's not unusual for that to happen when there's a 209.